right, so my other thought I had here, maybe, see, I don't want to have stuff going in between the house and there. I'm thinking we're going to add another branch off of here, maybe, and then have it stair step down to the ground. That way, anybody that's over on this side may be enticed to climb up because I, I just, I foresee this not going the way that I think it will. Every time you think you got it nailed down and you got a bulletproof plan, the zombies just find a way to fuck it up for you. So. Go out until it turns yellow. Trying to give them some options to get up because what they like to do is get caught in this corner and be like, ah, I can't get up those stairs. I'm just going to punch things. So then they'll get to here and they'll start doing their hoppy maneuvers. Yeah, it's going to suck giving them options to come from two different directions. However, when they meet in the middle, perhaps they'll start bumping each other maybe. I don't know. It's definitely better than them being all here all at once. Couple more cobblestone left. Definitely need more uh more cobblestone action. Need clay and stones. So I think this is a pretty good start. They're gonna get here and maybe they'll start bumping each other and they'll fall off and that'll start the issues. And then we'll be able to stay here and stab them. I got some concrete bars, three iron hatches. Have some extra fallback points down below, but that means they're going to have to bust through here and start raining in on us. I don't... I don't know. I like to think that the first horde isn't going to cause us that much issue, but at the same time, again, I can't walk four feet without my guy complaining he's tired and out of stamina, so... It's a little tough. a visitor and you're punching that what? oh it's a fat boy this is gonna do some damage to our house take advantage of some sneaky attacks oh there we go punched our own wall. All right, so all our construction materials are in here. We have, oh, that's not it. They're in here. Clay, we need rock like crazy. Hmm. Have no stone hiding anywhere else. Let's go ahead and make some more duct tape while we're at it. We gotta fill up these water jars. Figure out what other locations need some more hatches. Okay, those are secure. Um, those cellar door. 
probably going to be a problem. Difficult thing is it's locked here, which is fine, but I can't do anything with it. I have to build an iron cellar. Let's see. It will let me upgrade it. 10 forged iron. Uh, I feel like that's worth it to keep them from busting in down here. That's going to take a little bit to make. Um, got to find some more stone. I can't even repair my stone axe. That's not good. Um... Isn't there stone in here? Okay. Probably don't want to dig too much under the house. I don't need stuff starting to collapse. I just need a little bit of stone. Still waiting on this. can stay locked. I don't need to use that. I don't care about that. Um, okay. Still need stone because we got to make more cobblestone. Does not go as far as you would think. And they just cannot not smack my base. All right. She's locked on up here at least. Good grief. Are you going to try and climb up, or are you just going to punch the walls? And somebody else is punching the walls. There's too many pathing options for him, basically. Oh, he's feral. Alright, she's down at least. And he's down. And we've got a skill point. I don't know what all that extra was. 30% more damage. Craft quality four spears, which is going to use up whatever stone we have. Um, I don't know. I think that's the play because the spears are our uh, main focus here. Lucky Looter has not done much for us. We're slowly creeping up on Horde Knight. Fiber, small still. And no stone. Three thirty. Let's go find some stone. I don't know if mining into the side of that mountain, we just make our own mine. And we're gonna get some clay from this, but hopefully once we get into it, get some stone. We've got the makings of a mine going here. We're trying to make some cobblestone. We're running out of food. We have crap for recipes. We need to fill up our jars, boil some water. I probably can go do that quest Seems a long way away. A ways away. There's the POI we looted down the road. Traders over here. Is that the, the house in the middle of the water? T 
tempted to take the truck just because I'm getting really tired of walking. <laughs> Got 7% fuel. Creeping ever closer and I just do not feel like I'm even close to ready for it. Bad remover. Probably sell that. Okay, that was some lag, thanks. Um damn it. It's all the way on the other side of the lake. I was gonna say I could run it and then use the truck to drive back, which is still a possibility, but it's gonna be a little more difficult to get there than I thought it was. To get back home. There's no way there's not any zombies up here. There's no way this floor isn't gonna collapse. There's no way we didn't come here without any food. Who would do such a thing? Is that a backpack or a zombie? Uh, no, but we can craft gas. Uh, I mean, not ideal. Let's cheese up here real quick. Um, okay. Close enough, I guess. There's no zombies here. It's another one. That's not the same girl. Let's build our stamina back up. Hopefully we can knock her down because she is just sharp. Nope. Thank you. Thank you for getting your hit in on me. I appreciate you. Oh, my oh, I got... Max stamina is a little low because I'm hungry. He's got a tummy ache. I mean, who isn't a little starving in the apocalypse, right? Come on. Let's go, my guy. I'm going to have to put down a storage box because I cannot physically walk through this POI like I have an elephant on my back. Put it far enough away that it doesn't disappear. I've had that happen and, oh man. Talk about being a little upset. Put it out by the road. There's a flashlight up there, but there's also a flashlight down here. Or sorry, there's an overhead light down here, my bad. And we walked over a bunny's head. It's a crawler. Where's my bow? Okay. Save yourself a little bit of trouble. Damn it, we didn't. You know what? We're going to search the workbench and then we're going to activate it. Hey, fire axe. Yes, please. I'm getting really tired of chopping trees. At, like, I don't even know what the unit of measurement would be. Uh huh. You thought you were slick there, Vic. Thick Vic. So 
why you clear your hard corners. Oh, no workbench schematic still. No wrench to take that apart with. Ay ay ay. Well, we got a wire tool for, you know, the one day when we finally get traps and electricity running. At this point, I've got to save every ounce that I can. Mm-hmm. Man, y'all think you're slick. When I hit the door frame, there's no way I can hit his head. Oh, oh get up! That was a little dramatic. That was quite the, uh, like, corkscrew aerial twist maneuver. That was like when your little brother touches you and you're in front of mom and you're trying to act like they just punched you out and you just kind of overacted a little bit. You're like, oh, he just knocked me out, mom. I guess they're... Oh, yeah. Yep, yep, yep. I saw you clip through the wall, buddy. Not sure why there's a light there, though. Three, we got a level two sledgehammer. So, uh, oh, that doesn't have... So, intern... Go... Like, I'm a little confused here. Free repair kits. I'll take that. Ay, ay, ay. Uh, I don't understand why there's a lantern here. Maybe somebody can explain it to me because I'm lost on that one. There's a purse up there. Can't even loot that. Oh, on this. Just sell. Crawler. What? No zombies in there. It must be somewhere else then. Yeah, this is probably useless, but I could use the XP. Um, we have cloth and glue. We can. Do we have duct tape on us? We do. So let's make some duct tape. Take that. Sleeping in the kitchen. Uh, okay. Hey, look, another dramatic flip. You're not dead yet, though, buddy. Uh, okay. Just glitching out, it's fine.
soften them up a little bit since our stamina... Okay, cool. Stamina is a bit lacking here. Okay. I guess that's what it feels like when they get glitched through the door. Alright. Level up. I'll take it. Alright, where's that food? Since we're bitching that we're hungry. Our little tummies is hurting. Yucca seeds would be good to have if we make some farm plots. We're not going to have space to pick up the uh, quest item here. Keep fucking around. Get rid of some paper. Uh, scrap. Definitely need all the cobblestone we can get our hands on. Definitely want blue. No room for that. All right. Let's see what else may be useful here in GTFO. It would really be good to have. Damn. Uh, I don't have anything to cure dysentery. So drink whatever we can get. Stone and cement, sure. Concrete, whatever. Cement mix. Truck is out here. We're gonna take this to the trader, turn the mission in, then we gotta get home and Yeah. Here you go, friend. Whatever you need, just say the word. Oh pipe shotgun Oh my gosh, a forge, really? I need that. Yes. At this point the bike is not a priority. Um there's not really a whole lot I want to sell them. I didn't bring any of my sell stuff again. Wasn't planning on having to do this. Safe travels. Yep. Sure thing, buddy. Let's. That's a considerable ways away and not on our radar at this current point in time. We gotta get home. Yep, I'm encumbered, no surprise. Guess what? Water. Is that still on the Jeep? Truck. Four by four. It's like a Jeep, so. Put our forge we can put down. Where do we, where do we want to put that down at? I want to put it in the kitchen. Maybe we'll put it in the living room. There's our murky water. Uh, we're gonna need forged iron, so take that. Steal some coal.
start smelting. for later use. This box just doesn't want to open. I'm going to have to bash into it with this pick. Or not. Finally. I already know that. Four bone knife so we can scrap. Armor pocket mod. Another space for pockets is always good with me. Yeah. There we go. All right. We're looking like a true country boy here. I'm surprised we finally got into that stupid thing. trying to figure out if we should reinforce this from the inside which means I'm going to have to knock everything out that's here Anything in there since those are plates that's considered an extra block so unlike setting it there It'd be really nice to get a wrench. And I swear this guy's hungry, he's tired, he's thirsty, like... Come on, dude. What are you, 12? Still smelting. Oh, we got to put clay in there too. Um, we can do that. Do that. Add some more. We're going to need that to go with our stone for more cobblestone. Let that cook. Uh, what are we doing? Food. It's still day six. Can of salmon. A couple of eggs. Some blueberries. Fill us right up. Drink 
some agua. Sir. Sleeping bag for a sleepover. <laughs> We'll get some of that cranking. Come on, last one. All right. I'm trying to keep my fuel from all being used up unnecessarily since I like to leave everything running just, you know, for no reason at all. Schematic can go in the merchant box. I'll go in weapons and ammo. I've never used time charges. Honestly, I don't even know how to use them. I'm guessing when you set it down, you can pick how long you have, but I guess you'd probably use that more for breaching into safes and stuff. Stick with the pipe bombs and Molotov for the horde, probably. Well, I can stick that in here. I don't know. I feel like the horde's like coming right now and I don't know what to do. I'm just like panicking at the last second. I need to get some wood. Just go out and smack some trees real quick. All that chopping did not result in a whole lot of wood. Iron hatches. No, nope, it's still cooking. Just keep the forged iron coming because we know that's going to be a thing we need. No cement mix. Cool. This Horde Knight is going to turn into a shit show. Alright, well, it's now 2200 day 6. The Horde is fastly approaching. Um, I'm going to go ahead and end this episode here. Again, thank you for watching. I appreciate it if you stuck with it this far. I hope you enjoyed what you've seen. Please feel free to leave comments, likes, subscribe. Let me know anything you'd like to see. Any kind of constructive criticism, feedback. Maybe something uh, I can institute for the uh, next challenges that are upcoming. So thanks for watching and we'll pick it up right here where we're leaving off on the next one.